Mountain Outside Mountain Restaurant. That's the very literal and most likely incorrect translation. I guess this is the back of the restaurant and they're still working on it. Chicken. Yo, this is a farm fresh restaurant right here. Not even hungry, it's only hungry. <laughs> What's the facial expression for this? I don't know. <laughs> That's what it is. <laughs> That's a frown. We're back at the Ewu market today, and I think we're gonna look at toys because we've got this little monster with us. Well, since we're back here, we, I didn't do any research on it, but I did find out that this is actually the biggest small commodities market in the world. That's a fact. And they literally have everything. <laughs> you need some ribbons? How about some placemats that are made of beads? How about just some beads? How about some bows? Yeah, here's some bows for you. Oh, do you want fine jewelry? We got that too. How about some gold? How about some more beads? How about some silver stuff? Name it, we get it. <laughs> So I think up next, we're gonna go get something to eat, and then I'm gonna go play soccer. Have I played soccer in China? Oh, I did, yeah. When I used to live here, we used to play all the time. It was basketball and soccer court, but we usually played basketball. Got a random basketball court in the middle of the parking lot for some reason. So Andrew and them are going back to the hotel or somewhere, I don't know, I've not played soccer in China in many years. We'll see how it goes. We're gonna take the Chinese version of Uber, which is called Didi. No idea if this is a league or what, but oh my goodness, after not exercising for like two weeks, it's gonna feel so good. Look at this dog. I had two goals. One was to sweat a little bit, and the other was to not get injured. So far, I've achieved one of those goals. As long as I don't get injured, I'll be good. I've barely been running because my shoes don't have cleats and it's really wet out here, so I can barely even move without the fear of killing myself. <laughs> it was fun. It was about the same as uh, soccer in the US, which I don't play that much soccer, so I've managed to not make a complete fool of myself, so that's good. Okay, both goals achieved. Sweated a little bit, didn't get injured. Back at the hotel now. That's gonna do it for another day in China. We'll see you tomorrow. Thank you for watching. Thomas the tan engine. <laughs> <laughs>
Whoa, that's amazing. It's a good thing they don't sell these at KFCs, or I kill myself on them. What did you think? No. Okay. <laughs> Chinese KFC, positive rating. So I actually used to be really, really good at these and I haven't won in a long time, so that broke my losing streak. So Andrew, he took a nap. I went to play basketball. The guys there were pretty good, but now we're going to have some sort of food and my sister and her mom are already there, and we're on our way. And I think school just let out here. These are all grapes. Apparently they're taller than grapes in the US. I think you said they're ready in two months too. Do you realize how incredible it is that this is where our family lives? Yeah. Like our actual family. And it's not even that far off. Like, you two are related. And he's been living his whole life, and you've been living your whole life. Wearing the same shirt. <laughs> so this is Xinjiang food, which apparently is almost in Mongolia. So, as far as you know, do noodles have any significance? Birthdays, I know. New Year's, maybe. But birthdays, definitely. Oh, like the, long, the long reason day. I know that is because of Yellowstone. <laughs> yeah, I forgot. <laughs> So I've heard these referred to as phoenix claws. And like a phoenix and a dragon are like the two mythical animals mm. that... What was it, chicken? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's more like what you made at you, so... <laughs> Check out this house right here. She's got this random overhang and then like a porch up there and then a room. It's pretty sweet. There's also a bunch of bats flying around. Huh? So this tree is like a bayberry tree, was that right? Yeah. They said that they're best when they're black. The red ones are like super sour. Oh, like really? this is like a green one. That's funny because they were selling. Oh, that's cool. I'm take this. And there's some more right here too. Dude, this scene is like so idyllic. Right now. Yeah, this is super peaceful. To them, it's probably like super boring. It's <coughs> great. I don't know. They seem to be enjoying themselves. Okay, so this is calligraphy, obviously, but they don't know what it means either. We just dropped some stuff off at the hotel, and we dropped my sister and her mom off there too. They're gonna go to sleep, but we're gonna go to a movie, I think. And we're gonna see some movie called Master of Memory. I think that's a Chinese movie, so we may not understand anything, but hopefully the visuals will be interesting enough. <laughs> These side restaurants are pretty awesome. Yeah. I think this is it. This is the movie theater. Oh, wow.
Wine War. <coughs> oh, that's a new Pirates of the Caribbean. Why does it say five? Is this the fifth one? There was a fourth one, wasn't there? Was there? I don't even know that. Some smells really yeah, strong. Yeah. You know, I think their popcorn's better here. But Prices I, aren't too bad. I just like butter Wait, is that 60? That's super cheap. Which one? Movie's over. Spoilers. It was depressing. <laughs> Good movie, though. So, this is what this area looks like when no people are here. Pretty sweet night carts there. Sizzling on a walk. You know, that's good times right there. <laughs> That's where the wedding was the other day. Come here. I love it. <laughs> How are we eating another meal? I don't know. It just flavor gets you, and then you. Can eat. <laughs> Yo, I'm not even hungry. But this is amazing. It's like a long shot. Oh, it is fried. So I'm presuming we're going home at this point. <laughs> but who knows? <laughs> I did grab this souvenir though.